This video tutorial will show you how to open a code table request in GitHub for Arctos. First step is to get into the Arctos repository and into the issues, and then submit a new issue. You can see we have templates for various kinds of issues that you want to submit, and we're going to submit a code table request. Place information about the code table request you are making. So in this case, we're asking for a new catalog record attribute. And the attribute we're asking for is tail earth. Um, next is completing the template itself. This first part is um, instructions. So it's how to use the form, instructions about using issues in GitHub, and instructions on code tables. For now, I'm going to skip over these things and just delete them. But if you, it's your first time to complete a code table request, you may want to read some of those documents before you proceed. So what are we trying to do here? Um, we're trying to accurately record information about a cataloged item. Um, why do we need this? and um, not some other value. So this code table request came to me through a new collection. And what they asked for was tail girths and said it's not as the same, not the same as tail base width. So we're going to take their comment and put it right into here. So, the next um, item in the template is the code table. Which code table are we looking at? So we'll go over to Arctos and search the code tables. And we're looking at catalog object attribute values. So let's go find that, the attribute type. And this is the code table that we're looking to add a term to. Um, we'll copy the URL for that and put it in the issue. Oops, that didn't work out very well. Okay, that tells us which code table we want this term added to the term value. So we've already put that up in the top, but we will put it here again. And then the definition. And we can use the definition that was given to me um, by the new collection. Take this right here. Um, the catalog record attribute types um, don't have, uh, doesn't matter what collection, oh yeah, it does, matters what collection you're looking at. So the, the people who are requesting this are in a herpetological collection. So we're going to add this to herp collections. It may eventually get added to others. And if there were some that you can think of that it should be added to, you can go ahead and put it here, which in this case, um, a reptile collection would potentially use this as well. So I'll go ahead and stick that on there. Um, attribute data type. So this is telling us if the attribute um, is in you is a uh, some kind of numerical thing with units, which um, a tail girth would be that. Um, we want to to say that, so we're going to say number plus units. Some of these things are offered up here. 
So it's going to be a number plus units for this measurement. And um, we don't have an attribute value. It's not as if we're going to have some kind of drop down because we're going to be using numbers. So this one we can just leave. Um, and then the attribute units. So there are unit code tables. Go back to the table list. Um, and they're down near the bottom. So we have all these different things. We're going to be using the units of measure as the controlling units for this because they're probably going to be in centimeters or millimeters, I'm guessing. So we'll put this code table in as our units. And I did poorly at that. There we go. Um, the base URL part, this is for other IDs. So we don't need to pay attention to that. And same with other ID references, because that's not what we're asking for. And then it says um, a priority. Um, and that you do after, well, you can right here, click priority. Um, if you just put P here, it'll take you down to the I'm oh, sorry, maybe priority. Yeah, and this one's prior priority high because this incoming collection needs this attribute to get their data in. Um, and then we're also going to add this to the code table projects. That way the um, code table admins can understand that it's there. Uh, hit submit new issue and we're ready to go. So now this will be reviewed by the community and the code table admins and um, either the term will be added or there'll be some discussion about it and maybe a different kind of term will be added or it will be agreed that a term that already exists can be used. So that's how to make a code table request in GitHub for Arctos.